your Storm Shield forecast with NBC 26 meteorologist Matt Hoffman. We topped out at 31 degrees today in Green Bay. That was the first time that temperatures, high temperatures have been below freezing in nearly two weeks. It's been a mild stretch of weather over the past couple weeks, but that's going to be changing quite a bit as we head into February this upcoming week. Some other temperatures highs today. Appleton 28, Shano making it to 31 and 32 degrees in Wapaka. Right now in Green Bay, we are sitting at 29 degrees, a wind chill of 24 degrees with a west wind at 5 miles per hour. That sunset getting close to 5 o'clock, so we are adding daylight quite a bit each day, and that's a sign that spring will eventually get here, but we still have all of February to get through, and we know it can get quite cold in February, and that looks to be the case here for this upcoming week. Right now it's 27 in Appleton. The current wind chill at 17 degrees. Temperatures around the area, 28 in Kiwani for you folks. 28 degrees in Oshkosh as well as Fond du Lac, Sheboygan 28, 30 in Shano, 30 in Clintonville, and it's 25 degrees right now in Mountain. We do have a bit of a breeze out there out of the west. It's calmed down a little bit since the afternoon, but where we're seeing some of those stronger breezes, we're seeing wind chills dipping down into the teens. It feels like 19 right now in Sturgeon Bay. Satellite and radar picture still could see a few flakes tonight, but a lot of the widespread flurry activity is kind of wrapping up. And we're even seeing a few breaks in the clouds, especially north of Green Bay and then over towards uh, the Door County and Kiwani County area. As far as the broader view, we are seeing a little clipper system off to our north and west was kind of partly responsible to the flurry activity we saw today. This cold front will dip to the south tomorrow, so tomorrow will be a colder day, but we'll see a few flurries with this again tomorrow, but no big weather story to speak of through the rest of your weekend. So it looks relatively quiet. Any accumulations tomorrow with the snow likely going to be less than a half an inch, maybe a dusting at most. That's about it. We'll stay mostly cloudy tonight. Temperatures will dip